Hello friends, welcome to JavaScript tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to learn about the date object. Date object enables basic storage and retrieval of dates and times. Here, this is the simple syntax of how to use the date object. Here, date obj, date object is the name of variable and we have assigned date object to this variable. If we want to pass some parameter value, we can pass it through parameter. Let's see some method of date object. This is getDate method which returns the date of the month value using local time. Get day method which returns the day of the week value using the local time. Get full year method which returns the year value using local time. Same way get hours method get hours method returns the hours value using local time. Get milliseconds method returns the milliseconds of value using local time. Get get minutes method returns the minutes using local time get month method returns the month value using local time get second method returns the seconds value using local time same way get time method returns the time value in a date object as the number of milliseconds since midnight 1st january 1970 get year method which returns the year value here we can set new date also. To set new date, we can use set date method to set the numeric date of the month using local time. We can set full year using this method set full year. We can set hours using set hours method. We can set milliseconds also using set milliseconds method. Same way. We can set minutes, set month, and set seconds. Set time to set the date and time value in the date object. To string method, which returns a string representation of an object. To time string method, which returns a time as a string value. Value of method, which returns the primitive value of this specified object. Now let's see the example. Here this is very simple example of date object. Here we have used date object and we have assigned this date object to our variable new date. And then we have written this variable using document dot write method. Let's see the output. So this is the output of our program. It shows the current time and date. Saturday. Here this is month, this is date and this is full year. This is the full time. Local time. Let's see another example. Same way we have assigned date object to our variable new date. This is our variable date string. And we are adding these values of these methods into date string variable. New date dot get month plus one which shows actually the get month returns the value from zero to 11, 0 for January month and 11 for December. So if we will write plus 1, it means we are getting the month from 1 to 12. So here we have used plus 1. Get date to get the today's date and get full to get the year of local time. Let's see the output. So this is the today's date. This shows the month. 
this is the date and this is the full year let's see the another example to set the date here we have assigned date object to our variable d in function then we are using set full year method to set the whole date and then we are change the inner html of this demo id of paragraph tag here we have passed year 2013 then 0 for january month and date is 4th now let's see the output here i am going to click this button so here this is friday this is a day january month for 0 and this is date this is full year i hope now you have clear idea about this date object and its methods.